Hello everyone and welcome to Matchbox Memories. I was at a diecast show in Vancouver uh, this weekend and I found these two 10 packs. Uh, now I have most of the cars in these packs. I was just looking for the exclusives. I did miss them when they hit Walmart uh, a few years ago and I'm very very excited to open these packs up and have a look at these vehicles paying particular attention to the two exclusive vehicles which is the 2015 Dodge Ram in police livery um, so I'm gonna spend most of the time on that and then just quickly uh, gloss over the rest of the vehicles because for the most part we have seen these cars before so uh, very very quickly let's just look at the packaging this one's slightly damaged I paid I think seven dollars and fifty cents for this one Canadian so about five US maybe six US uh, which is a good price. These sell for about, uh, I think, I can't remember if it's, I think it's about $25 Canadian at uh, Toys R Us now. And Walmart has stopped um, uh, shelving these. So they're the vehicles. Um, you can see the exclusive is the Dodge Ram, the 2015 Dodge Ram. And these are from 2020. They came once or twice to, to Walmart and I was indecisive in whether I should buy them or not because I did have all the other cars and when I decided that I wanted them they were gone and they never came back so very very happy to add these two vehicles to my collection so let's uh, open this up and have a look at it. All right so there are the vehicles outside of the package and let's just look at these cars very very quickly. Um, I'm just going to pull them all out and then have a look at them and then I will jump into the next uh, next nine pack all right so i've removed all the vehicles from the case and we're just going to look at these one at a time so first of all we have this police car it is a subaru impressa wrx from 2007 it says keeping sa safe i wonder if sa stands for south africa South Australia, lots of <laughs> lots of options here. Keeping SA safe on both sides. I'm not sure what the SA stands for. If anyone knows, please do uh, type it out in the comments. It seems like a very specific livery. It's almost like the English police cars. That's really nice. Blue tinted window, black interior, black base. The yellow tires actually, the rims work on this. It's a good looking car. Okay, next we have the police interceptor, the Ford police interceptor. Skybusters livery police interceptor. We've seen this before. Uh, this comes in a wheel variation as well, which I have in my collection. I didn't pull any uh, comparisons. And of course, the front's not detailed, unfortunately. But good set of wheels. It works for this particular vehicle. Black base, black interior. Once again, blue tinted windows. Two cars in this set have two. Both the police cars have blue tinted windows. Um, okay, next, the Porsche Rally. Porsche 911 Rally from 1985 black base front's not detailed back's not detailed either it's just the sides seen this before we've also seen it in blue and then we saw it uh, as a target exclusive in brown i'm not sure this is a nine pack exclusive but anyways i think it's the first one of this that i have i have this model but this particular livery it's the first one i have in my collection it says outback buggies turbo rentals au so maybe australia again the baja bandit it's a very old casting it's very very cool fantasy but there's something uh collectible about it look at that holden Golden UTE SSV from 2010. I just purchased the uh, the new red Matchbox Target 
exclusive vehicle it should be uh, in Vancouver in the next week or so I'm very very excited to add that to my collection I think I already have this uh, but let's just have a quick look at it purple with a black interior these are all all these cars are from 2020 so it's been a few years since we've looked at them but look at that fully detailed back and front this car looks magnificent this vehicle the Julia I think it's called the Alfa Romeo Giulia Giulia 2016 I'm not sure how do you enunciate that I see these in the roads of Vancouver sometimes I've heard that they are a nightmare to keep on the roads because they are they need a lot of repair beautiful car though look at that and they also I did a bit of research because I was interested in buying one and I also heard or know that they don't hold their value very well in the second secondary market but in terms of design they are absolutely fabulous sort of a dark gray base with what looks like a black interior All right next we have the Austin Healy in this cream color good set of wheels red interior convertible detail front and back look at that beautiful 63 Austin Healy 3000 MK2 pretty sure I already have this in my collection but uh, can't vouch for it all right the, the reason I bought this 10 pack so basically I paid ten dollars for this one vehicle because pretty sure I have all of those Oh, and there's, of course, the helicopter, which I'm not going to show you guys in detail. It is what it is. It does have this rotating uh, blade. Um, let's have a look at this. So this is the fifth or sixth version of this vehicle that I have in my collection. Saf safety service and security, highway patrol. We've seen this... Uh, livery on several uh, matchbox police cars so no detailing on the back but you do kind of see a little bit of the the real lights from the sides uh, but i love this casting i wish they make more of them the 2015 dodge ram difficult one to find guys really difficult one to find All right, I do have more. I did pull out a few of the Rams, but uh, I think we're gonna have a look at this nine pack first, and then we'll have uh, a look at all the Rams um, that I have in my collection that I pulled. There are a couple that are carded, that are in uh, tubs somewhere that, I, uh, that I'm not sure <laughs> where uh, they are. So, uh, okay, let's open this up and have a look at these cars as well. So I guess uh, before I open this up, we should just have a quick look at the cars. Um, you can see that green Porsche is a repeat. Um, not very happy when they do that because they do release these nine packs in pairs and it's somewhat disappointing when the cars are repeats. So this is also from 2020 and you can see the exclusive vehicle is exactly the same uh, as the previous nine pack we looked at, but in white, uh, exactly the same livery as well. So I'm just going to open that up and we will have a quick look at it. Oh, and I did pay $10 for this just because it's in uh, better condition than the previous uh, time pack we looked at. All right, so I've taken those vehicles out of the package. Let's have a quick look at them. This is the G-Wagon, the Mercedes-Benz, 2015 Mercedes-Benz G-Class. I've already seen this vehicle, guys. I recall there being some kind of variant on this tire, um, but I can't remember what it is. But anyways, that is, uh, we've seen it before, don't want to spend too much time on it. There is this fantasy vehicle, which is something tracker, what tracker is it? Trail tracker. Once again, it says SA Fire Service. I'm not sure if that stands for South Australia, South Africa. Could be anyway, it could be something that Matchbox just made up. Seems like it's a bit of a running theme in these five packs. It's an interesting vehicle. 
It is fantasy, but not a bad one. Range Rover Evoque in this blood red. Completely tinted windows, detailed back with the Evoque number plate and a fully detailed front as well. Good detailing on this. 2015 Range Rover Evoque. Good. Decent set of wheels. The Honda Civic, I thought this car would be way more popular uh, than it was. Um, still not an easy one to find. You don't see too many of them um, in the secondary market. This one's fully detailed. It is the 1976 Honda CVCC. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful casting. It's too bad about the little safety bar that they put in the back there. But other than that, it's a very, very well-designed vehicle. Another Porsche, same one we just saw. Um, 1970, sorry, 1985 Porsche 911 Rally. And I'm pretty sure there's no variance between the two just because, uh, let's have a quick look since we have some time here. Yeah, they look identical. Back and front. All right, not gonna spend any time on that. Let's have a look at this Mustang police, or is it a sheriff? Yeah, Mustang sheriff car. Oh, it's Boone County. So this is part of the Boone County theme, which uh, coincidentally is also one of the Dodge Rams that I pulled out, uh, which has also got a Boone County um, livery on it. I like this casting. I like the um, the lights, which is uh, connected to the screen here, the windscreen and the light bar. It's a beautiful car. I like this casting. I'm not sure if I have this in my collection. Happy to add it. All right, this blue convertible Mustang. Also one I'm not sure I have in my collection. 2018 Ford Mustang convertible, black base, gray interior, detailed front, and we are fully detailed, look at that. It doesn't wanna focus in on the number plate here for some reason. Oh, it's struggling. And then we also have a Porsche, another Porsche. Seen this one before as well. Detail back and front. Porsche Cayman 2014 license. It's good looking. I think this is one of the nicest versions of this particular vehicle matchbox has done. All right, and then the Dodge Ram exclusive, the 2015 Dodge Ram exclusive in the same livery as the one we saw in black. Safety, service, and security again. Once again, the front's not detailed, neither is the back. Nothing in the bed. It's too bad they don't make a variation with something in the bed with this particular vehicle. Left-hand drive, yeah, beautiful. Okay, so those are the cars we just looked at, and now we're just gonna have a look at the uh, Rams. So those are the other two Dodge Rams, 2015 Dodge Rams that I had loose in my collection. I also have the, um, I think it comes in a metallic ash color, and also one with the uh, green uh, National Parks livery that I have in my collection, but I haven't opened and they're, at, they're in tubs somewhere. But uh, these are the ones that were easy to find because they were already loose. Um, we've seen them before, but let's just quickly have a look at the two that uh, you haven't seen on this video yet. So this is, like I said before, it's the same Boone County Sheriff as the Mustang we just looked at. So you can see that. Uh, this is This seems to be an ongoing uh, sheriff's theme that Matchbox um, 
has a license with that particular sheriff's department. And we have seen a few different vehicles with this theme um, over the few, last few years. And of course, we have this fire version um, of the Dodge Ram as well. All right, guys, a quick video today. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I'm really, really happy to add those two vehicles to my collection and uh, expand on my 2015 Dodge Ram collection. These are two are probably the hardest, maybe not the hardest because the National Parks version is really, really difficult to find as well. Um, but anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I am gonna make more videos. I have tons of stuff to go through. Um, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so and don't forget to hit the like button on YouTube.